I'm going to show you a dead easy way to check a mirror. It's a G05 X5 and BMW mirrors these days, they're not very good compared to the old ones. But I'm going to show you a dead easy trick. It's literally a two second job. I'll explain how the system works first though. Okay, we've got a big problem. We've got our indicators on. But they only work at the front and they don't work here on the sides. They're dead. The dead as a door. So all we're actually going to do to test this function, it's really, really simple, is there's two wires that control the mirrors. There's no CAN bus, there's no LIM bus, it's just a straight voltage line, pulsed line. And then there's a control unit inside the mirror for the LED circuit, which will then turn that signal into, um, probably it'll step the voltage down from 12 to five or whatever. Maybe it's 12 volt LEDs, we don't know. But either way, it'll turn this signal into another type of signal to activate the LEDs through the circuit board. There's two wires, that's it, on this circuit. You've got a ground, which we've clearly got, as you can see. And you've just got this blue one, which is the actual, from the body domain controller, this is the actual feed from the body domain controller. And usually you'll have a little bit of voltage on there or a ground when it's not active. So we've got like a ground with some errant voltage on it. So let's go ahead and activate it now. And put this on the power probe on. And you can clearly see the body domain controller sending a signal you can actually see the lights there i'll just turn the kit the camera lamp off you can actually see that it's going from negative to positive just moving like that so really you don't need to do any more diagnosis do you the, the problem is obviously quite simple the problem is inside the actual mirror unit it's as simple as that so it just needs a new mirror, unfortunately. Well, uh, indicate a part of the mirror if we can get it separate. And then we'll be in business, won't we?